And we're back. This time, try not to die. Well, it's gonna ask me to hit the button. Okay, well. Well then. The light on my controller went red when I died. That's a nice little touch. All right, third time's the charm. There we go. Yeah, he's not. Ooh. Oh, that was nasty. Yeah. Speaking and everything is moving. This is creepy. Scary too. Go to the light. Just avoid the rocks. Yeah, thanks, Doctor Obvious. <laughs> Follow the light. Crawl it's actually the... cute the L two R two and it's like like two little feet going. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yay! So when is she starting to find artifacts? You know what? I don't know. It doesn't look... It looks like more like stuff is happening to Lara Croft than her... Mastering no, the well, environment to her own needs. Well, I was gonna say raid tombs. But... <laughs> <laughs> it looks more like the tomb is raiding her. Yeah, she looks like she uh, just came out of the tomb. Tomb Raider! And then the R dissolves into a D. Tomb Raided. <laughs> Yay. Art gallery unlocked? Yeah. We might check it out eventually. More cutscenes. Jeez. The lifeboat. Where are they? Yeah, there was a bunch of people earlier. You mean on the boat or on the island? On the or... island, I thought. Okay, take it slow. Oh. Show map! Oh wow, well. show map. It's oh, not... it's not working. Or it didn't work. Show map. <laughs> That's horrible timing. <laughs> So I disabled the uh, the sound coming out of the controller. It may have disabled oh, the... I see. Or maybe it requires a microphone. I don't know. We'll have to check it out. The game seems to be using all the little tricks. Okay. Okay, the light... The, the, the sun through the clouds, it's so ominous. Yeah. But is it morning or is it night? Uh... Well, like, afternoon, sorry. Morning or afternoon. Ooh, nice, game. a plane. That... Oh, yeah. How do you can do what? Like, jump and grab onto this? Like yeah, she... but since the beginning she of, can do uh, this. of okay. the game, you missed so many of those jumps. Well, she... I missed twice at the same spot. And it wasn't jump, it was a kick. No, but all, in all the cutscenes, oh, every time she jumped... Well, I'm not responsible for that. It. You are, Lara Croft. Not during cutscenes. Ah! Are you okay there? Yes! Yes! It's just that so many things are happening to her. It's just... And so just... is that like a horror game or adventure game? Uh, adventure is probably the right term. Uh, like Tomb Raider originally was clearly sort of a, a heavily inspired on Raiders of the Lost Ark and so on and so forth. You know, Indiana Jones. Yeah. So. So not so much horror, but adventure. Originally, I again, I know very little about this game, uh, so I mean, we're still technically in the introduction, so who the hell knows what the tone is going to become. Uh, 
matches. matches. Hold their water. What was the first thing? I sort of. It's a camera. Was... Oh, a camera. Cool. Thanks. Can anyone hear me? See, that's totally a sat phone. That's not a sat phone. That's just like a walkie-talkie. It's just like a radio. Oh, oh, that's not good. A sat phone usually like has an antenna about like two feet long. Oh. That you can bend in two and then just like hide behind the the, the radio. Media's light to me then. Yeah, it's clunky. Whoa. So I mean, the uh, what prompted this game was playing, uh, watching the new uh, la, la, la. Blade Runner. Blade Runner movie. What did you Blade think Runner. of Blade Runner? Love it. That's it. That's it. it. That's all. It was great. <laughs> That's kind of it, really. Well, there's so much to say about that movie that just like it's kind of hard to know where to start. Yeah, for general, like a general statement is I loved it, and but I still think about it. Please respond. Right. I'm still. I mean, I'm not surprised, but I'm still amazed that so many people walked out of the movie when we watched it. Yeah, people walked out of the movie and the kid beside me fell asleep during the movie and his parents decided to walk out with him. Well, to be fair, I'm not blaming the kid on this one. I blame like the parents. He was seven or eight years old. He had no idea what he was doing there. Such a slow-paced movie for a kid who's who looked like hyper. <laughs> yeah, it was not a greatest movie. For a second there, I thought you said it wasn't a great ass movie. It's not an ass movie. I know there what you no meant. There were no ass. There were boobs, but no ass. So many boobs. What did you think of this? Like, did you think it was kind of exploitative that the movie had so many boobs or artsy? Or what was your take on that? I didn't really care because they were pretty. So wait, you don't, <laughs> you don't care about boobs as long as they're pretty boobs? No, it was just like, even for me, it was nice to watch. But no, I, I don't know about that. If it was like... I would have to think again about the, the whole movie or just see it again to see it like how it fitted the narrative. Lara Croft in her native habitat. Right. She's on the hunt for the lost What's up with the, home to the fabulous like shaky cam, but not shaky as in shaky cam, but more as in like constant tremor. Um, this is serious. Oh, sweetie. Y you never... You never saw like when I'm, I'm actually recording something, I shake so much that for me this is very stable. Oh god. I don't like watching people, uh, how they, uh, they, they record because it's all shaky, but I'm worse. Oh my good days. I trust you, Brock trusts you, you got this. Now let's take a break, okay? Okay, okay. And Sam, thanks. Oh, wait. So wait, is this black and white or in color? Sepia. What? Wait, what? Oh, no, there's color. Yeah. It's just... It's kind of weird. We've all got some kind of stake in this. The funding won't last forever, Whitman. That's precisely why we should push east, not west. No one believes Yamato... No one believes Yamata is that far east. The books simply don't support it. Well, whoever wrote those books never found Yamata. I talked to Ruff about this. There's no point in following in other people's Is that Japan? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. The, the map looked really old and stuff. Yeah, but it, it looked like the, um, the island of Japan. Right. So why is there like a, a team of archaeologists without a single Japanese person on board on an expedition to a Yamatai, Jap Yamatai Japanese, presumably a tomb of some sort? Going east will take us directly into the Dragon's Triangle. That's where we need to go. Lara, my little bird. I'd follow you almost anywhere, but that place a bad energy. Bad storm oh. more like makes the Bermuda Triangle look like Disney World. Okay, well, that's a ragtag crew if I've ever seen one. Queen Himiko? Is she someone uh, Like, is an actual person? Yeah. Oh, go check it out. Yep, that's what I'm gonna do. 
doesn't look good. I swear I can sail on it. Oh, come on. Tell me you're serious. Himiko. We don't have the funds to fish about. It's now or never. Lara's offering fresh ideas and a plan. I'm the captain here. There uh, was a shaman queen of Yamatai Koku in Wa, early what Chinese dynastic histories chronicle. Tri okay, so it's not Japanese, it's Chinese. And Queen Himiko or Pimiko. Yeah. yeah. So oh, presumably. No, Japan. Japan. What? Yeah, Japan. Well, Japan is close enough to China. I can see it. Yeah, but she was recorded in, in Chinese uh, histories. Okay, fair enough, fair enough. 248 AD. Okay. A little while ago. Right, well, I think now is a good time actually to split this. What's our time looking like? Yes. So I have to go back to my time now. Let's see. Yeah, that's about a right split. So uh, we'll stop the episode here and then uh, carry on this later. Yep. All right.